Hey what's up guys this is Vimal here and welcome back to TRHD. Today I've got something very awesome to show you all. It's a brand new smart AI camera from Xiaomi. This tiny camera has some awesome features like it can recognize your hand gestures and shoot photos for you without anybody's help. That sounds awesome right? Not only that it's got more other features which I'll tell you in this video. It's made by Xiaomi and the model is Mi Jia Xiaomi AI smart camera. Looks like everything is written in Chinese on the box, that's because it's available only in China for now. You have to import it from websites like Gearbest. It's got some nice features like live filters, Wi-Fi connectivity, magnetic body and also gesture support. Let's see what's written at the back. You got some specs here. This AI smart camera has a built-in 910mAh battery, supports Wi-Fi, has an f2.2 28mm lens with a field of view of 76 degrees. So those were some of its specs. Let's get started with the unboxing. I want to thank Gearbest for sending me this product for review. By the way guys, Gearbest is celebrating 11.11 .11 sale currently and are offering some huge discounts on products, so do check out their website. Plus they are also arranging a special giveaway for you guys. I'll tell you about the giveaway details later, so make sure to watch this video till the end. Alright on opening the box, we've got the Xiaomi Smart AI camera at the top. Whoa, this thing is small. Looks really cute. It comes only in white color. We'll come back to that in a moment, first let's see what else do we get in the box. You've got a card at the top with some instructions on how to download the compatible app and pair with your phone. And a user manual, just make sure to read that for full info on the product. Along with that you get an original product certification, a spare sticker base for the camera and a USB cable for charging and data transfer. So these were all the items we got in the box, now let's check out the Xiaomi AI camera. This thing looks quite small and cute guys, I really like the design. It's got a 13 megapixel camera on the front, let me just peel the sticker on top of it. There you go. Wow, the build quality of this camera is really good. It looks of very high quality. You've got the Xiaomi branding on it. It's got a 13 megapixel autofocus camera with f2.2 aperture and also has an LED flash about that. This AI camera is very lightweight, weighs only around 65 grams. The outer body has a nice matte finishing, let me give an overview on the design. Looks like we've got nothing on the sides. Ok at the top there's a microphone and a power button about that. The Xiaomi Smart AI camera has a unique design, the back plate actually comes out, it's attached magnetically, let me take it out and show you. So this is how the inside looks like. Now this camera can be attached to any surface either magnetically or with the help of this suction sticker. So it can stick to almost any kind of surface. The magnets on it are also quite strong, as you can see it quickly attaches as soon as you bring them close. Let me show you what's on the camera here. You've got the product info and under this flap you've got some ports and buttons. There's a micro SD card slot, a micro USB port for charging and a reset button. It supports micro SD cards up to 32 GB. The back car of the camera has multiple functions, you can even use it as a magnetic stand for the camera, just like this. That is awesome right? You can easily place it on any surface and not only that even the camera's angle is also adjustable. Just tilt the camera at whichever angle required and it will stay there in that position. The back car not only sticks at the bottom, you can literally attach it anywhere on the camera, like on the sides, left or right and even at the back of the camera. So now you can stick this onto any surface like a wall or mirror and shoot your own portraits without anybody's help. That is really cool, I love the way they designed this camera. It's made in such a way that no matter where you are, in which situation you are, you can shoot your own full length portraits. Plus with the addition of gesture recognitions, you don't even need to touch the camera. I'm really looking forward to put this to a test. So now what I'll do is I'll power it on and show you all of its features. To power on the camera all you need to do is press the power button at the top for about 2-3 to three seconds and then you'll see the status LED ring blink like this. That means your smart AI camera is on and ready to be paired. Now let me show you the camera's compatible app. The app that you need to install on your phone is called the Xiaomi app, it's available on both Play Store and App Store. And this is how the home screen on it looks like. Now you need to click on this little camera icon at the bottom to connect to the camera. And there you go guys, you can already see a live preview from the camera. Not bad, the video quality in the live preview actually looks good on the phone. So this is how the interface on the camera app looks like. As you can see there's a slight input lag in the live preview, but that's not a big issue. And one more thing guys, this camera shoots videos or photos only in vertical mode. There's no option to adjust or rotate anything. Now let me tell you about the interface. You've got a shutter button here, a timer function, gallery on the left. At the bottom you've got 4 different modes, photo, video, burst mode and time lapse. You can just click on them to change the mode. At the top you've got beauty mode, video light, flash and more settings. Let me show you the video light. 
so you can use that LED light above the camera as a constant video light. You can even adjust the light intensity in 7 different steps and I have to say that tiny LED light is quite bright. It also has HDR support and has AI hand gesture recognition. So using hand gestures you can shoot photos or videos. I'll show you the different gestures in a moment. First let me show you the available settings on it. So in the settings it shows you the camera's battery level, Wi-Fi status, camera storage. Below that you got the gesture settings which include palm clench fist and V sign. You can enable or disable them from here. Along with that you've got some more camera settings like toggle 5 GHz Wi-Fi band, grid, camera light effect, watermark and a smile shutter option which when enabled the camera clicks photos whenever you smile at it. So those were all of its settings. Now let me show you how the AI gestures work. First let's try smile shutter. So whenever you look at the camera and smile it automatically detects and shoots your photos just like this. That is awesome right? Along with that you got some more AI hand gestures like palm clench fist. Whenever you do this gesture the camera detects it and starts taking your photo. You can even adjust the timer settings from 0 to 3 or even 6 seconds. Similarly you can also show this V sign to shoot photos. These are some really awesome and useful features but the accuracy of detecting the hand gestures was not that great. It was doing good 60% of the time but was struggling to detect the gestures especially in low light conditions. I think I've already told you that this camera also has autofocus on it. It's got face detection autofocus and you can touch anywhere on the screen to focus and adjust the exposure. Now let me show you some photo and video samples that I shot on this camera. The Xiaomi Smart AI camera has a 13 megapixel sensor with an f2.2 28mm 5 element lens. It's got a field of view of 76 degrees. The photo quality was actually nice but it was shooting all the photos and videos only in vertical mode. There was no option to change it. Even the aspect ratio was fixed. I wish the company gave some flexibility to adjust the camera options at least in the next software update. Talking about the picture quality, the sharpness was nice, there was good amount of detail in the photos, the colors were rich and accurate and the white balance was also good. The dynamic range was also decent on such a tiny camera. Since there was no option to rotate the photos on board, I have manually rotated them later in the post processing so you'll get a better idea on the quality of the pictures. Just have a look at them. The most fun part about the camera was its ability to stick to any magnetic surface. So you can just place a camera on any tall lamp posts or gates or any other metal surface and get some unique shots from different angles. You can either use a camera app to shoot photos and videos or even use AI hand gestures. I really love that feature on this camera. Here are a few more samples shot on it. Just check them out. Now let me show you some video samples shot on this camera. It shoots videos only in 720p at 30fps that to in vertical mode. The quality was okay for watching on small displays like your phone but I didn't understand why the company limited the resolution to only 720p. They should have at least given 1080p support. Just have a look at this clip. Ok now let's talk about the battery. It's got a built in 910 mAh battery and on an average I was getting around 1.5 to 2 hours of continuous working time with all the features like Wi-Fi and hand gestures turned on and charging the camera took around 1 hour. So that was my review on the Xiaomi Smart AI camera. It's a good tiny camera with some unique features. The build quality is top notch, love the different ways you can interact with it, shoots some good 13 megapixel photos and gives a decent battery life. The only thing I felt was they should have given some options to switch between vertical or horizontal shooting modes and also the video quality could have been better. This Xiaomi Smart AI camera costs around 6000 rupees. I'll just leave a link to that in the description box below. You can check it out there. And before I end the video, I told you there was a special giveaway right? Yes guys, Gearbest is hosting a giveaway for 3 products which I've reviewed recently. To participate in this giveaway you need to do this simple two things. First is you need to open the 11.11 .11 Gearbest sale link and comment down below your favorite product from that sale. And second thing is you need to share this video on your Facebook. That's it guys, by doing these simple two things you'll automatically enter in this giveaway. This contest will run for about 2 weeks from today and after that 3 winners will be picked randomly from the comment section and announced on both my Twitter and YouTube channel. All the giveaway details will be in the description box below. So that was it for today, hope you all liked it. Thanks for watching, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more new awesome videos. And I'll see you 
in the next one.